right, everyone. Hello. I'm going to try to start this live again this morning. And today we're going to be talking about sexual enhancers. And we're going to be talking about the pros. We're going to be talking about the cons. We're going to be talking about um, buying from a store versus buying online. Um, and we're going to be talking about my experience with the liquid kangaroo. So I'm going to give you all a chance to log on. All right, and if y'all have any questions, just let me know if y'all have any questions. All right, so let me just say this. Um, sometimes people come in and they say, oh, you know, like I just had a, a, a couple come in and a man was coming in, he was getting a, um, the rhino and the woman was trying to get the kangaroo and he was like, what you need that for? Let me, let me explain something to you. Sometimes people really need an enhancement. It's not that they're not attracted to you. It's just that sometimes they just need a little boost. Okay. That's all an enhancement is, is a boost. That means something has to already be there. Okay. An enhancement ain't going to help if you not attracted to your husband no more or not attracted to your boyfriend no more, or you with somebody that keep on cheating on you and you feeling like you're the fool for continuing to lay up with them and you know they out here having sex with all of these different people. Sexual enhancer ain't for that, okay? Sexual enhancements do not fix those type of problems. I have to make sure I let you all know that because I get so many inboxes about things that are irrelevant to a sexual enhancer. No, a sexual enhancer is not going to make you love him. No, that's not the purpose of a sexual enhancer. So I just want to make sure that we're on the same page about what an enhancement does. An enhancement is to make better, okay? That means something had to already be there, all right? So we got to use a little common sense here. I, 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 sometimes I be feeling like um, Ashton Cushion about to jump out at any moment now and tell me, Sharonda, you being punked from some of the stuff that y'all send me. I just need y'all to understand that sexual enhancements are not miracle workers for everybody. If you're on chemo and radiology and you have like major, 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 major health issues, you cannot compare your body to a woman who is healthy because at this point your body is not healthy. So when you're taking a sexual enhancer, I need you to understand, have a realistic expectation. You cannot compare your body when you know that you, you have a lot of medical issues going on to a, a, a regular healthy woman. I need us to be realistic about that, okay? Um, another thing, you know, a lot of times people say, well, Sharonda, what's the difference between Kangaroo and Pandora? First of all, Pandora been on the market since I've been in business. Pandora has done wonderful for women. I have women that come in here and regardless of what else comes out, they continue to go to Pandora because that's what they know. That's what they're familiar with. That's what they know that has worked for them in the past. So they want to continue. It's kind of like if it ain't broke, don't fix it. I don't need to try nothing else if I know this works for me. Kangaroo is just a new pill that has come out. Personally, I do feel like kangaroo is a little stronger than the Pandora pill. Pandora pill, you're going to get you about two good days of fucking out of Pandora pill. But kangaroo pill, you're going to definitely get you three days, Okay. Now, the difference between the kangaroo sex shot and the pill for me, and this is my personal experience, okay? On the pill, I can go to sleep, okay? On the pill, I get this craving, this desire, pussy jumping, extreme wetness, like just a crazy type of feeling. And when I see the dick, I just want to eat it up. Like, seriously, when I'm on the pill. Now, I took the sex shot this weekend. For me, I have had a better experience with the pill. Now, with the sex shot, did I have energy? Yes, I had so much fucking energy, I ain't slept in three days. I was frustrated because I wanted to go to sleep and I could not go to sleep. So, does it help you stay woke? Hell yeah, it helped you stay woke. Okay? Are you? Do you get wet? Hell yeah, I got wet. But I didn't have that strong uh, craving and that just that strong, my pussy jumping 
type of feeling. I didn't have that with the sex shot, okay? I did have that with the pill. The sex shot, if you need to stay up, if your issue ain't that you don't want to fuck and all of this kind of stuff, and your issue is you just tired and you need something to help you to stay woke so you can get that dick, then by all means, get the sex shot or get the Spanish fly because the Spanish fly is just that. I always call this that I don't get tired because you you going to be woke. Taking this here. You gonna be woke. Taking this shit right here. You ain't going to sleep. I mean, and I'm one of them people that I, after I get dick, I can sleep good. When I tell you I can sleep good, I can sleep damn good. On this shit right here, I done watched all of the American medicines. I done watched all the motherfucking housewives that I done caught up on. I done watched the good doctor. I done been up all fucking night long, all weekend long. Watching show after show after show because I didn't got dick and I can't go to fucking sleep. So I'm just giving you the real spill from my experience, okay? So, you know, everybody have different things going on with their body, and I just need people to be just realistic. I do have the um the new kangaroo that's coming out this week with the libido. Hopefully it will be in today. If not today, definitely by tomorrow it should be in. Um I'm going to put this down. Now, my ladies that do not have libido, let, let's just talk, let me talk about libido. Libido is produced by your ovaries, okay? If you have had a hysterectomy, if you've had a partial, if you've had your ovaries removed, if you've had any type of those female procedures done, okay, and you're not having a cycle anymore, that means your body's not producing libido, that is the reason why nothing is interesting to you when it comes down to sex because you don't have libido in your body. This is called on libido, okay? This is a natural way to put libido in your body daily. What you do is you open this up, you squeeze this, just press down on it, and it's a liquid that's going to come out. And what you do is you rub it on the back of your neck every day. Rub it on the back of your neck. What this does is it puts libido in your body that your body is not creating on its own anymore. This is one option. The next option is Velextra. Velextra is a pill that you take that puts libido in your body, okay? Then we have, now some people, their problem is not that they don't have libido, okay? Some women are never had any surgeries done, but their body's just going through the natural change. That's why I tell y'all to be, y'all need to be using lubricant. Because as you get older, your body is not producing as much lubricant as it did when you were 17 and 18 years old. You know, menopause does not start when you just get older. Your body gradually goes through the stages of menopause. Now, not agro. Niagara is strictly to create moisture in the pussy. That's all this is. This has your shit wet, flowing like a river. That's what it does. This is to help with you getting wet, which has nothing to do with desire, which has nothing to do with staying up all night. It has nothing to do with any of it. This strictly to get your pussy wet. That's all this do is to put this in your body to constantly make it create moisture. Because again, your issue may be different than your sister issue and your heart issue may be different than your cousin issue. And your mama might have a whole nother set of issues, okay? And let me talk about this before I end this live video. The same way they have people that bootleg purses, that bootleg washing powder, that bootleg anything that you can ever think of, you have people that bootleg pills too. So for my candy pinchers who don't want to pay shipping, who want to order everything from Amazon, don't contact me when that shit don't work for you from Amazon. Don't you dare inbox me about something you ain't get from me. Don't. Because what I know is these A-Raps come right here to my store and they offer me rhino pills. Literally half of what I pay the manufacturer. Now, that sounds like a good deal because guess what? If I can get it from half of what I'm already paying the manufacturer, that means I make more of a profit, right? The thing is, I really don't give a damn about making more of a, pro more of a profit. I want to make money, but I don't want to make money at the expense of you taking some shit that I don't know what you're consuming because they made that shit in their kitchen 
and put a fucking label on it and selling it. So when you go into the local corner stores and you're getting your different pills, I need you to understand that those people that are selling you those pills don't give a fuck about you. I need you to understand that. I need you to start taking pride in where you get your stuff from. You need to deal with people who have a genuine concern about you and your health. Okay? I'm not going to give you something that's going to have you ready to take your whole damn head off because your head won't stop hurting. I'm not going to give you something that's going to do that to you. Okay? I just need y'all to understand that. I have had customers that deal with me. And guess what? They go to the corner store because they got it. Oh, it was a better price down there, Sharonda. But guess what? They bringing their ass right back here to me. You know why? Because that shit had them in the hospital. And this shit that I'm selling is authentic, real shit. Because I don't deal with nobody but the manufacturer. I go to the people who make it. So I ain't getting nothing from no third party, fourth party. I don't know where it came from before it got to me. I don't do business like that. Because me and my husband take this shit too. And we ain't taking no anything. Okay? I'm the guinea pig. I try this shit out before you get it. So if that's the case, that means that I'm going to put my health, my husband's health, and everybody's health in danger to make a few more extra dollars? No, I'm not. Okay? I need y'all to just, just be thinkers. Okay? And another thing is, a lot of times, you know, y'all spend, and I can't tell people how to spend their money. I cannot tell people how to spend their money. But I just wish that I got online and I seen Cindy's doing a live video. If I got online and I seen Horse doing a live video, it pisses me the fuck off when I sit here and I give all of this good information for free. And then y'all take y'all black asses over there and go spend your money. I have a problem with it. And I'm going to let you know I do. So you can't say that you didn't know that I have a problem with it. Because I feel like if that's how you spend your money, bitch press unfollow and go follow them. And ask them to put a live video for you every week. To teach you some shit to turn up in your bedroom for that motherfucker who half the time don't even deserve it. Oh, yeah, I said it. Mm -hmm. So, anyway, Rhino Pills, men, make sure you're dealing with companies who are reputable. Amazon, Amazon do not give a fuck who they get it from. They just want to make money on selling it. They make money on us subscribing to Prime memberships and shit. They make money all types of ways. And another thing is with Amazon, you don't know how long that shit sat in their warehouse. All of this shit have a shelf life on it. All of this shit have an expiration date. That means that we got to move it in a certain amount of time. Or it ain't no good no more. Just like your prescriptions that you get from your pharmacy. It's only good for a certain amount of time. And after that, you got to throw that shit away. So with Amazon, you don't know what you're getting. All you know is the packaging kind of look like what Sharonda be talking about. It kind of look like it might be. I would hope that you love yourself enough before you take something and put it in your body that you say, you know what? I'm going to go spend my money where I know it's real. And even if I'm not in Baton Rouge, I'm going to go to her website because guess what? I know it's real. I know Sharonda don't do no type of flaky type of business and I know it's real. Okay? Next thing I'm going to talk about and then I'm going to let y'all go because I know y'all trying to get ready for the holidays is pheromones. For a long time, I sold one called Buy the Do. I absolutely loved it. The manufacturer stopped making it. Well, Pure Instinct, the company who makes the um, pheromone oil, this is the concentrated one. This is the small one that you put on your neck, and then you go walk around Walmart, the damn motherfuckers be following you in all kind of weird way, and you try to figure out why they following you like that. It's because you got this pheromone shit on, and you're a sex attractant, just in case you didn't know that. Okay, you this here mixes with your regular body uh, pheromones and it creates a unique scent that's just to you. Okay, you can wear it along with your perfumes and everything, but the scent is unique just to you. So the way it smells on you is going to smell completely different on your friend. And it's the same bottle, but y'all pheromones are different. So this is the concentrated one. Now they've come up with the body mist. When you get out the tub, this is an oil, okay? So when you get out the tub and your body is still kind of damp, drop with the towel because your body is still kind of damp. But then you take this and you just spray it all over your body. It's just kind of like a spray baby oil. That's what it kind of reminds me of because it has vitamin E and different oils and stuff like that. But it smells so good. Oh, my God, it smells so good. So you take this and you spray this all over your body and you just rub it in. And again... It's a unique scent that's just to you. 
unique scent. He, it, it's going to smell completely different on the next person. Okay? So this is, again, Pure Instinct. And this is the concentrated one right here. And another thing for my ladies, if you know that you, again, have been on chemo, you know that you have went through hysterectomies, you know that you have some serious, serious, serious medical issues going on, sometimes you got to spend a little bit more if, if you're still interested in saving your sex life. This is on arousal gel. Now, you don't hear me talk about this a lot because this is $40. And $40 is kind of pricey for an arousal gel, okay? But I have my a lot of my older ladies come in and get it, and they spend this $40 on this. I've been selling this for years, but you don't hear me talk about it a lot because Orgasmix works wonderful, and it's half the price, okay? But for my people that have like a special, special, special case, meaning that you got some shit going on with your body, and it's completely different than what the average woman is experiencing, then sometimes you got to spend a little more, and this is called On, okay? This is On, and as you can see, the bottle is really tall, okay? You only need one squirt, and it goes directly on the clitoris. And again, the same company that makes this also makes the On Libido, okay? This is for the people whose body is not producing libido anymore. Um, and, you know, sometimes people ask me, and, and I always try to make things make sense. What's the difference between Kangaroo and Pandora? That's like saying, what's the difference between Tide and Game? Both of them are enhancers. A lot of times it's about preference. Some bitches don't want to fuck for three days. They do not want to get dick for three days in a row, four days in a row. They be needing breaks in between now. Okay, well, you might want to do a, a Pandora pill because it's not as intense as the Kangaroo, okay? However, the, the shit still works, okay? Because for a long time before Kangaroo came out, Pandora was all we had. And we was happy with them little two days that Pandora gave us, okay? Then another thing you have to understand is your, your body weight, your, your BMI, body mass index. Meaning, a little woman that's 120 pounds, she going to take this Kangaroo and this shit going to stay in her system three, four days. She going to be jumping around. I'm talking about cutting up. Well, if you got a body mass index and you a larger woman and you 300, 400, 500 pounds, you know that pill is not going to have the same impact on your body as somebody that has a smaller body mass index, okay? I need you to take all of these things into consideration. That's why when your doctor prescribes you pills, they put in your weight and your height, and then the, t the system tells them how many milligrams that you're going to need to fix you by your weight and your height. Okay, that's why dosages for children are different than adults. Dosages for animals, and sometimes they take the same shit that we take it, but it's different from them than humans because they're smaller. So I just sometimes we gotta think our way through this stuff. Okay, let's see. How much is the pure instinct? Oh, let's see. The concentrated is fourteen ninety nine, and the big bottle of the oil is nineteen ninety nine. Let's see. I just want to make sure that I answered everyone's question. And yesterday, the sale went really good. The buy one, get one free. If I on it, then um, just stay tuned for the next online sale because there will be another one. And if you're not following my website, you need to go register because the re let me tell you something. The website gives coupons. The website gives uh, percentages off of things that I'm not even talking about here on live in the store. But if you come in with a coupon, then we're going to honor it. Okay? You can't expect to get these deals if you're not on my website. You have to be registered in order to get these deals. The website is www.thepppgstore.com. www.thepppgstore.com thppgstore.com and another thing because I just had a man call here ladies don't go online with that man credit card um, using his stuff up because let me tell you something once they tell me that the payment is cleared I'm shipping that shit to you You he can't be calling me talking about what he got to do to get his money back bitch you going to be in jail fucking with that man credit card leave them man's stuff alone if you ain't got permission to use it or you need to have some open lines of communication to be like, look, baby, I'm trying to turn up. I want to fuck you for three days. 
I want my pussy to jump, I want my clit to stand up, and I want to make this pussy tight. Can you buy the bundle for me? It's only $55. Can you buy the bundle for me? Open your motherfucking talk. Let the man know. Look, I need you to buy the bundle for me. It's $55. I want to fuck you for three days. I want my pussy to jump, clit to stand up, and I want my pussy tight all at the same goddamn time. Can you buy it for me? $55. Okay? All right. Y'all enjoy your holiday. Um, on a whole nother note, for those of you all who are like me and your parents have gone on to heaven, I want you to still find something to be thankful for, okay? I don't want you to spend your holiday in the house all upset because the death angel came to your family, okay? Let me tell you something. One thing that is certain in life is death, okay? We all got to leave here at some point in time. But what we have to do is make sure that we live the best life that we could possibly live, okay? Enjoy your holiday. That's it for my live video.